from Chi Town, Gillespie presents the show with your host, Tone and Shag, featuring the game, Johnny P, and Lorenz and Lamar Tate. Tony Shag, welcome to the show. Chicago's first celebrity yes. talk show, man. Y'all give yourselves a round of applause. Please. Right now for coming on out. Look, it's so beautiful, so shepherdly out there. Yes. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Now, we're coming to you live from 212 on the river. Thanks a lot. Y'all give 212 some love now for coming. 12. Lake and Canal. Make sure you come hottest on Hottest nightclub. Hottest nightclub. Jumping on a Sunday. Oh, yeah, we would definitely not be here if it wasn't a hot nightclub. Big hot hollers out to 212. Thanks a lot for letting us use the space. Now, this is what's up. We got a great show planned for you, but a bunch of guests planned for you. We got a jam-packed show. We have Lorenz and Lamar Tate in the building. Y'all so right. Chicago, Chicago Zone. Chicago Zone, West Side. Yeah, West Side, yeah. Now, and uh, to end it all off, man. Yeah, you got to keep it Chicago. Got to keep man. it Chicago. Yes. Uh, R&B. Yeah, R&B, single. Y'all know something about Johnny P? Yeah. He's on the show. Yeah, yeah. Going to definitely sing to you, so. We do our show on Power 92, 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. And we had a That's chance right. to catch up with G Unit's game, right? G Unit's game. We're gonna check this interview out, man. So uh, y'all look at the screen. And here it is, man. Check him out. G Unit Game. We got our man the game all the way from the West Coast in the building. What's up, fam? Man, cold as a <laughs> For sure, man. That's how we get down in the middle of the country, baby. It's cold up in here, man. Yeah. Definitely gotta give you your props right now. The documentary, dog. First of all, you didn't make a couple songs. Uh, everybody was kind of like, well, okay, he got some hot stuff on the mixtape. He got some hot singles out. What is he going to do with his album? The album is crazy, front to back. Yeah, I appreciate that, man. And, yeah. and I know it to be true because, you know, I've been, you know, we've been on this promo tour for a minute, man, and I'll be hearing the same thing everywhere, man, which is nothing but positive and, and makes me feel, you know what I'm saying, wonderful at the end of my days, man. Me and Dre... We set out two and a half years ago, man, to, you know what I'm saying, to bring the West Coast back, man. And I think that in 17 tracks, you know what I'm saying, on my debut album, the documentary, we did it, man. I check this out, man. All right, when you came and, and did Power 92 show, when you, when you first came to the market and you did the show, I, I saw you pay homage to uh, Michael Jordan by, by changing, you know, the, the Jordans yeah. on stage. Yeah, man. You big basketball fan? Yeah, yeah, man. You know, I played uh, for Washington State, you know, back in the day, man, when I was fresh out of high school. Oh, word? Ended oh, up okay. getting kicked out of college, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> yeah. for some little drug violations. But, uh, my, you know, my best friend, Baron Davis, he right. went to UCLA. We was, you know, in the Pac-10 together, man. And oh, okay. uh, I, I came back, you know what I'm saying, to the hood. Everybody's disappointed, you know what I'm saying. I put my hoodie <laughs> on, tuck my head down, and then start yeah. doing slang. So, and so you was the one that they was like, man, you going to make it. Yeah, they called me a park legend, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, that, and that's what made me mad. And I switched up my professions and I took over the rap game. Man. Yeah. Yeah, I saw you on Insta. I stuck with Baron Davis. Yeah. I was like, man, I was like, y'all was cool. He's like, man, I'm telling you, Baron Davis came right on. He's like, man, my man, the game, he coming out. He about yeah. to be the next hot cat. So that's your guy for real, huh? Yeah, that's my guy. That's my son, Godfather, man. So, oh, okay. You know, I've been knowing BD since we was about five years old, man. And, and I used to murder BD, man. I don't care. What? Yo, 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 I'm going to tell you. Oh. I was like, I was like Callie's Ben Gordon back in the day. Uh, you know. Real quick, just real quick before we let you out of here, dog. Just get a hot boys a little something, a little something so everybody know what we talking about, I, man. I, I'm going to give you something, you know, it's for informational pur purposes only. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Okay. So, you know, hit a breakdown. No detox. I'm comfortable, dog. Like the soul on Rebox right up under me, dog. And it feel like I've done it before. Sit in the throne, polluting the airwaves like a hum exhaust. Don't let Machiavelli fool you, homie. Thugging the cars. Pour out a little liquor for the loved ones that we lost. You ain't got to wait for my album. I don't hope with the source, but I turn up my B.I.G. and let it bump in the Porsche. I mean, turn up my Easy e and let it bump the Porsche, tell him to roll red carpet when he come in New York. Hip hop police on me, think they run in New York. Till I lace my air one, show him how to run in New York. They trying to take me downtown, put me under the court. Cause Joe Buttons told him I carry a gun in New York. And homie, that's strictly fact. He got ripped on wax, so he snitched just to get me back. Here's a little advice, homie. Switch your raps, cause that on your last album ain't get you plaques. Yeah, that's what's up. 